Verse 57. Then said the Jews unto him, Thou art not yet fifty years old, and hast thou seen Abraham? Man, Abraham been dead so long. What are you talking about? <laughs> you seen Abraham. You done lost your man. <laughs> uh, thou, you ain't even fifty years old yet. <laughs> Jesus said, verse 58, Unto them, Verily, verily, I say unto you, Before Abraham was, I am. I am. Before Abraham was, I am. Verse 59. Then took they up stones to cast at him. But Jesus hid himself and went out of the temple, going through the midst of them, and so passed by. <laughs> you see what Jesus had to deal with? In... It was all prophesied. The scripture said he was going to come unto his own. And his own was not going to receive him. Who is his own? The tribe of Judah. Of the seed of Abraham. It's ten tribes. Jesus come from the tribe of Judah. That's his own. He come unto his own. But his own received him not. Not all of them. It says but as many. As many who? As many of his own that received him. To them gave he power to become the sons of God. That's in context. That's what you have to understand. So every time you read the scripture, you have to keep them in context. If you don't, you're going to be out there in la-la land, saying anything and everything about, the, like the Pharisees. They didn't know what they were talking about. That's why everything they said was wrong. Jesus had to make a correction to everything that they did and said. Y'all don't know me. You don't know my father. <laughs> and the same thing today with a lot of these pastors and preachers and teachers in these 501c3 churches. They don't know what they're saying. They're telling everybody, yeah, everybody can be saved. Everybody can be a Christian. That ain't got nothing to do with the scriptures. Jesus said, be my disciples. And he only came to Israel. All right, so... Just go and search the scriptures and see if what I'm saying is true. Thank you for listening. I'll pick it up next time in St. John chapter 9. Shalom.